New Orleans is said to be the most haunted city in the U.S. We took both the ghost tour and the voodoo tour, and we will share with you what we discovered. Stick around, if you dare. Where I grew up in southwest Louisiana, my mother and grandmother would tell me all kinds of stories about the grigri, or what's also been called the hoodoo magic of the Louisiana bayous. But naturally, when Michael and I visited New Orleans, we wanted to learn more. New Orleans is a place where the dead refuse to rest. Maybe it's because there is no solid ground to hold them, or maybe it's just because they are kept alive through our stories. Everyone who passes through New Orleans wants to know more about voodoo, but almost no one in the city tells the whole truth. We looked hard to find a tour that would give us the real story, and we think we found one. The company Free Tours by Foot New Orleans gives a couple of voodoo tours, but only one of them is led by Roby, who says he has been ordained a high priest of voodoo. He does come from a long line of folks who practice the art. We met up with his group in Armstrong Park, at the site of the original Congo Square. Congo Square is an open space where slaves and free blacks gathered throughout the 19th century for meetings, markets, and African dance. When the French came and colonized, i.e. stole the land from them, they pushed the uh, natives back. And the French brought with them our ancestors, the Congo people of West Africa and the Senegal people of West Africa. Local voodoo practitioners still consider Congo Square a spiritual base and gather here for rituals. Our family did a ritual yesterday. It's been, I'm inviting y'all, by the way, if you haven't been out here yesterday, every Sunday our family sets the drums up over there in the circle and we do a whole public ritual. Free Tours by Foot is indeed free, but you will need to register on the website and pay an optional scheduling fee. Then after the tour, you will be asked to give an optional tip of the amount you think is appropriate. High Priest Roby is an LGBT force of nature. He is authentic, engaging, and hilarious. I think he's my first person who I designate as a hidden gem. He is passionate about the history of voodoo and tells his audience the truth about the religion and strips away all you have gathered erroneously from movies and television. He also takes you to the site of the former home of Marie Laveau. He appropriately dispels some of the myths surrounding her and instead emphasizes the strong woman she was during that time period. These weren't exactly the stories that my parents would tell me, but they were steeped in the same traditions. They would also tell me stories about the ghosts they would encounter and believed very deeply in the supernatural. Me, not so much. This tour was also by Free Tours by Foot and the guide was Andrew. The best part is that the stories he told weren't over exaggerated and each had a tie to some aspect of New Orleans history. For example, he talked about the table that the staff at Muriel's restaurant still sets to this day for its resonant ghost. He talked about the horrific torture and abuse that a slave owner committed here. That pain echoes to this day. On a lighter note, he told the story of the cross-dressing ghost at Tujac's former restaurant. A couple at the restaurant had taken a selfie in the dining room, but were surprised to see that the ghost had photobombed them. The tour guide showed us this photo. That ghost is believed to be Julian Eltinge, a famous cross-dressing actor of the early 1900s who was once a regular at the restaurant. Apparently the ghost's picture had been moved to the attic, which made it very angry. Do you believe in ghosts yourself? Let us know in the comments. Don't go anywhere. Watch this video to see what's next on our adventures, and please don't forget to like and subscribe to see what else is coming. Finally, check out our merchandise store, where you can create fully personalized t-shirts, greeting cards, mugs, and more, all of which help support the growth of our channel. See you in the next video.